After Effects also gives you the ability to animate in 3D space. Now this doesn't make your characters, your text characters, three-dimensional. It just means that you can move them around in 3D space. Let me show you how this works. I have this animating text project open again. And I'm going to open up the layer and I'm going to animate, let's say for example, position. Now you notice here that we have an X and a Y position. That's because this is a 2D layer currently. Now we'll talk in much more detail about what a 3D layer is a little later on in this training series. But what we're going to do is go back to the animate menu and we're going to select enable per character 3D. And what that will do is it will allow us to work with these characters in 3D space. Notice now that there are three values for position, X, Y, and Z, or three-dimensional depth. And as I adjust this, it looks like scale, but in actuality, we are bringing this text closer to us and farther away. If we add a rotation property to this animator, then you notice that we get X, Y, and Z rotation as separate properties. Let's say, for example, we adjust Y rotation. You can see that these characters are now rotating in 3D space. Let's bring these characters really close to us and make sure we have Y rotation on a little bit, maybe not that much. Just a little bit, maybe negative 40 or so. And then now as we adjust the range selector, you can see the difference this makes. The characters go back and they rotate back to 2D. Now to give you an idea of what you can do with text animation presets when they are working in 3D space, I'm going to go back to Adobe Bridge. I'm going to do that by going to the Effects and Presets panel, go to the Flyout menu, and select Browse Presets again. Once here, I'm going to open up the text file again, and this time I'm going to go into the 3D text folder. These are presets specifically created for 3D animation text. So you'll see some interesting options here. For example, 3D bouncing and centered this text moving in 3D space. So you get all sorts of cool spirals and flips and reflections. There's also this extremely cool uh, 3D text around a circle. Very cool stuff. So as you can see, the world of text animation is a big one in After Effects, enough to even include moving and animating in 3D space. In the next movie, we're going to look at how to add some visual effects to our text by using layer styles.